everyone and welcome back to my channel. If we haven't even met before, hi, my name is Shiv. If you're coming back, then welcome. In today's video, I have a huge, pretty little thing haul, which I'm so excited to share with you. I've got a big bag. I've also got two other little bags for like kind of spontaneous follow-up purchases. So this is like building my wardrobe kind of vibes, but also a few little bits for my upcoming holiday. I'm going to a music festival in Croatia in a month's time. So I kind of want some cute fit. So there's a few, there's a mixture of stuff in these bags. But if you'd like to see what I picked up from Pretty Little Thing for kind of the months of June, July, then please carry on watching very hot in this room let's start with a few holiday kind of bits so i picked up this kind of linen sort of just very very lightweight beach shirt dress and i thought this would be just so cute this is in a size 10 it's oversized so you know if you wanted to go smaller you could if you want to go bigger you could i'm just gonna wear this like open on top of a bikini and i thought this would look so cute with this bikini that i'll show you next but also like with a lot of my other bikinis just for like lounging around because this music festival I'm going to was staying in like a cabin type thing and I think it's a hammock outside. I just thought for like the mornings like make myself a coffee when I'm like really really tired <laughs> from all the festival goings. I just thought I'd just chuck this on just so I've got something over me. So yeah I thought this would be like a really really good holiday find. It's actually a really really nice material. I'm not really like usually a big linen, per linen person but this feels really really nice and just looks so cute. I also think you could wear this like outside of a holiday with like a white bralette blue denim shorts and just kind of chuck this on i think that would look really really cute so yeah i picked up this linen shirt next bikini obviously a little bit difficult to show you i'll either do a try on or i'll show you a picture from the website depending on how comfortable i feel with the try on but this is a really cute bikini this is like a daisy print bikini how can i show you this Hello. So this is a daisy print bikini. It's got like a clear back, which I think is quite a nice detail actually. And this one does have a slight bit of padding in, which I do like. I like a padding in my bikini. Just to make me feel a little bit more confident. But it's just black with white daisies. And then this is the matching bikini bottoms here. It's not like a super, super thong, but it's not like a super full cover up. I kind of feel like the full cover up bikinis don't look as flattering on me personally. So yeah, and I really like the fact on this bikini, which I thought was a really, really nice detail you see the straps are actually like that kind of see-through almost like a extra bra strap material which i really like i feel like that would be really flattering and kind of make you look nice and curvy and i'm really sorry if i use the word flattering too much in this video it's just the best way to kind of explain my vision with the clothes but yeah i really like this it's got nice like v front so yeah this this with that linen shirt i thought could be a really cute little outfit next up again it's kind of difficult to show you but this is another bikini it's got like a gold like tortoise shell kind of detail in the middle it's really I can't how do I even show you this like this it's basically like a wrap over bikini again I'll do a try if I feel comfortable to or I'll show you a picture on the model and then this is the matching bikini bottoms again with that tortoise shell detail which I think is so nice I actually am really into like the animal print bikinis at the moment I think they are so nice and just looks so cute I like, imagine with a tan with like wavy hair jungle vibes love and then I got the matching dress and the dress is actually what drew me into the bikini because the bikini top doesn't have padding not a fan. So I picked up this beautiful dress. Like, look at this. This is a mesh maxi dress, but it's super thin, so it's not going to make me really hot. But I thought this would look so nice. It's kind of like open, so the bikini shows. If you can kind of see that goes all the way down with it slit down the side for kind of like a nice breeze. But look at that material. I thought I could wear that with like some kind of green glitter like on my cheeks but it looks so nice. Yeah, I really really like that and I picked it up because of this dress. Next up, I just wanted to show you some random accessories I bought. I bought two belly chains because I feel like they look so nice and just make the bikini outfit look that little bit extra but without kind of adding too many layers and things so the first belly chain i got has this kind of like gold balls around it and it's like double layered i think this looks really pretty that could look really nice with the animal print bikini when i'm not wearing the dress or even on top of the dress i don't really know maybe i'm trying to be a little bit more experimental with my fashion like i got my basics now and i can add the extra bits but i just got this belly chain 
And then I got this one, which I think is, oh my God, it's so stunning. This one here, which is just like a rhinestone. One, I'll do a close-up shot for you now, but it's just got these pretty rhinestones that kind of sparkle with rainbow all the way down. I think this could look so nice with so many different bikinis that I have. And also to be honest, like I've seen girls wearing these like cargo trousers with like a little crop top and then a belly chain. It looks so nice. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with those. Going back to the kind of animal print outfit, I also picked up these are really cool sunnies they're like this olive green shade and i thought they would look so cool with that oh i actually quite like these they are massive I've, i don't really feel like i have a face for glass like sunglasses for glasses i do not for sunglasses but we're just gonna roll with it pretend we are fake there's no pictures please no pictures but yeah i thought this would look really really cool they are absolutely huge as well so kind of look like a bug it's not really one car like this i don't know i they are really big actually you know i'm gonna rock them on holiday i am I am and no one's gonna stop me. Next up is a very black pile of clothes, so not super exciting, but all really good picks. Firstly, I picked up this little crop top because I'm all about trying to get into my basics for my wardrobe and I thought you can't be just a black crop top. It's a jersey material, doesn't look see-through or anything like that. And it's just a very an essential item basically so yeah I needed like a black crop top just a plain one I got a cute dress which I saw which I thought about wearing to work with like trainers or boots or something you know me I love a dress I'm a dress girl for sure but it's called a fit and flare dress so I think it looks quite flattering like it goes in at the waist and then it has these flared sleeves which I really like a flared sleeve I really do it's like witchy kind of vibe like ethereal you know what I mean and then it's got a plunge neck which you can kind of see but I'll do a try on for you in a second with buttons all the way down and it's just a nice knit I think for right now it actually would be too hot because you're having a bit of a heat wave here in the UK I think it's like 28 29 degrees today but maybe for like chilly up days or something and then the best thing about this dress is I can definitely wear it in the autumn winter months <laughs> months with a pair of tights and like you know knee-high boots or something just a good essential black LBD next up this is full intention of being my airport outfit girls and boys we know we love an airport outfit last year i didn't get a good photo of my airport outfit i was really sad about it because i was really excited to get a cute picture of my suitcase i am such that millennial i love taking photos but yeah i just want something really really comfy for the fly flying at lunchtime it's not super early but cannot be sat in like jeans or like a dress you know so i picked up these black shorts they're just like a sweat material i'm sure i'll be boiling when i reach the other side i'm going to croatia they're just kind of fleece lined on the inside but yeah super cozy i also kind of think i can never predict what the weather's going to be like when we return so it's just nice to wear these also on the way back so they're just black sweat shorts i actually have like a few pairs of these from pretty little thing that i've kind of collected over time in different styles but i don't actually have a black pair or like a black pair of joggers so i thought i'd start with a pair of sweat shorts which i'm going to wear to the airport to go to croatia next up is a hoodie which is to go with that that. so i'm gonna wear the black crop top the black sweatshorts and then this hoodie and then when it gets too hard to wrap it around like my waist or also the benefit of taking a hoodie with you on a flight is you can use it as a blanket for your head or like just snuggle up with so i got this hoodie here this is from the renew range i do quite like the renew range i think i've got a few bits from there and it just has like renew on here i quite like the logo actually i'm not a big logo person but i think that looks really nice and kind of understated um, it's just a big black oversized hoodie it does have an elasticated bottom the thing about this is because it's not cropped that's absolutely fine you can kind of use it to give a bit of shape big pocket in the front it is super soft guys like pretty little things loungewear is second to none it's so good like the inside is all thick and lovely yeah just black hoodie and i feel like i need a black hoodie anyway so yeah that's that next up is a, another jogger set which i'm really excited about this one is a little bit more like luxe looking this is my vision of like that girl going to the shop get her matcha hairs like this little gold hoops Hello. yeah this one is also fleece lined and this is a nice like cream color with plt on the leg but again it's not like too overbearing big pockets i really need a new pair of joggers like mine have like random stains on i bought them all during lockdown and i have not like 
replenished my sort of loungewear and I work from home most of the time so I pretty much live in joggers but yeah they are a straight leg jogger which I do like actually they just go all the way down there's no like elasticated bottoms which I think actually like if you're going to wear this out like say if you're going to the cinema you could wear this with trainers and it looks a lot more put together I personally feel than um an elasticated one I don't know why it just adds something else to it so yeah, I just got these the cream one hopefully I don't get like makeup and stuff on them and then I got the matching hoodie which just looks like this again PLT logo on the front it's like a rubbery kind of material big pocket super super soft goes all the way down the ends do have elasticated sleeves and I just thought I need to replenish my loungewear collection I just know that I'm really gonna love both of those you have to forgive me I'm very poor next thing we have is a PLT jacket shake out the tissue paper which is so cool do i say so myself it's like this pu leathery kind of material big leathery jacket obviously it's not real leather i wouldn't buy real leather anyway but this is what it looks like it can go all the way up i'll probably just wear it open i do love a bit of like faux leather i have a big long coat i got from pretty little thing like a couple years ago and it's even last year i can't remember it's like my favorite coat i love it i call it my matrix one i just i just love it i do i do so i think that's so cute you could wear that on top of the hoodie like when it gets a bit colder on top of that dress i bought it's a really like versatile jacket i think it's just a bit different as well because it's not all black or all white so yeah i really really like this and think i'm gonna get a lot of wear out this jacket okay my camera is dying but that was everything i got on my pretty little thing haul i really hope you enjoyed watching um this video if you did please give a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already it means the absolute world and stay tuned for the next video i'm hopefully going to churn out lots of content soon which i'm very 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 excited about i'm very excited about my new wardrobe things <laughs> but yeah thank you so much for watching i'll just see you in my next video